here under the water tower at Guadalupe Central Park, you'll find repaved sidewalks, newly planted trees, and dog waste bags, but city leaders tell me more renovations are to come. I'm Jacob Dizon, your community reporter in Guadalupe, where Central Park is getting a makeover. I feel like uh, it's gonna make that park look um, very nice. And like, I feel like people are gonna like to come like more often. Wednesday morning, I met Ruby Garcia, one of the few Guadalupe community members out walking her dog through Central Park. It's pretty quiet, but it's also good to see more faces. In an effort to bring more faces out to Central Park, City Administrator Todd Bodum tells me pretty soon, a basketball court, skating areas, barbecue pits, and art murals will all be going up. Just gonna be totally re-enhanced, remodeled, and updated park for the city of Guadalupe. And though Central Park's renovations are far from finished in the few years she's lived in Guadalupe, Garcia says she's taken notice of recent upgrades to other local parks in her neighborhood. The Boys and Girls Club, so in the park area right there, they fixed it, they made a new playground, and the school got rebuilt. It looks beautiful there, right? Yeah. Bodum tells me both park projects were made possible through state grants, adding that over the next three years, $80 million worth of projects will take place around the city. The city is truly becoming a real multimodal community from uh, we're, we're going to electric buses, we bicycles. It really is becoming a destination. According to Central Park's renovation plans, a new playground, board game tables, and exercise equipment will also be installed upon the grounds, as well as a new coat of paint for the iconic Guadalupe Tower. I feel like more excitement to come for a walk every morning, more motivation. <laughs> Bodum tells me work on Central Park will continue over the coming months and should be wrapped up by the end of next year. In Guadalupe, Jacob Dizon, KSBY News.